What's up guys and your boy is back with the news. Samsung's future flagship phone could bring more cameras on any phone that you have used in your whole life. As we talk about the future of Samsung's smartphone camera, we also have some news on what's almost here and that is the Galaxy Note 20 and the Note 20 Ultra along with the Galaxy Fold 2. But first, let's take a look at this possible Samsung future camera game. So, out comes a patent via Let's Go Digital showing off a Galaxy smartphone phone with six cameras on the back. Yes, not counting the front cameras, just six lenses on the back of the phone. The patent describes four of them as main wide camera lenses with big sensor size. The other two lenses could be zoom and ultra wide. Now, interesting thing here is that these are not ordinary lenses. They can actually shift and tilt. A tilt shift lens can massively improve the image quality and most importantly, the composition of the whole image. Another thing that is mentioned is multiple cameras that can work at the same time to produce one image. In one of the examples, it's been discussed that the four wide lenses are set to be 32 megapixel in resolution where all of them work together to bring one single image that has more detail than a 100 megapixel sensor image. This actually seems really interesting. Samsung likes to try things out of the box like we have seen with the variable aperture back in the days. It was amazing seeing a smartphone camera doing that but of course it ended up being not that beneficial hence it was removed but this one could be a really good move. Certainly Certainly more interesting than a single 150 megapixel resolution lens. Now I kind of understand why Samsung is giving some of its sensors to Vivo and Xiaomi because for their own flagship phones, they probably have some interesting plans like this. Also, the Galaxy Note 20 family, we talked about the colors recently. Additionally, Samsung might actually bring more colors to the Note 20 family, including a red color, light blue, and a light pink. Alongside the Note 20 family, we're going to see the Galaxy Fold 2 and now we actually have a battery leak for that. According to the information, we have a 4,365 milliampere battery cell for the Galaxy Fold 2, which is almost the same as the Fold 1. The display this time around is not only bigger, but it's also having a 120 hertz refresh rate. But interesting thing is the LTPO display tech, which is again, extremely intelligent refresh rate. Hopefully the battery performance will match the previous Galaxy Fold, if not not better. Battery has never been an issue on the original Galaxy Fold, so I think it will be enough for the Fold 2 as well. Now we also have some live images of the Galaxy Watch 3 if you are excited about that. It will be rocking a brand new ECG heart rate sensor, some improved internals, and some improved software features. As for the announcement, it's gonna get announced alongside the Galaxy Note 20 and Fold 2 on August the 5th. Samsung is also looking to unleash its 120Hz tablet for the first time, which is going to be the Tab S7 and S7 Plus. We have some new leaked renders showing off a familiar design. I think in the Android game, these are the best tablet anyone can offer. So yeah guys, that's all the latest news. Samsung's upcoming Galaxy smartphone could use some interesting technology, tilt shift lenses with multiple high resolution lenses working together to just produce one image. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Also, don't forget to mention your favorite Galaxy Note 20 color and I'll see See you guys in the next one. Peace out.